Good morning! Welcome back to Vlogmas 2. So, two out of the three weeks I'm doing this. Today I'm shooting with Hannah. We've just shot one outfit post for January and she's just gone to get a coffee because we need coffee and a bit of cake. So, it's only 10 to 10. We're starting super early, so hopefully we can finish early. Um, I'm just going to change into my second outfit. And then we've got a really fun day. So we're going to be in Bristol shooting, then we're going to Cleveland to shoot, and then we're going to my house to shoot. So really, really fun. You probably would have seen most of the content by... No, actually not by now. The content will be coming out sort of this week. So yeah, I hope that you love the content we're making. Um, I'm going to try and vlog as much of today as possible because I think it's really interesting seeing sort of behind the scenes fashion. And then I'm going to chill out tonight because... I just had the maddest day yesterday. I didn't go to bed till one because I was prepping for today and got up early and Nelson knocked down the Christmas tree and it was just stressful because half my decorations are made from China. So as you can imagine, when I was running late, that was not ideal. So yeah, I'm just gonna get changed and then I'm gonna do like little time lapses of us shooting and obviously introduce you to Hannah who is the best photographer in the whole of Bristol, legit. We are in Clevedon, we're going to do some photos here. So pretty. Right. Hi everyone! <laughs> this is really awkward. Right. So Hannah is taking videos of my, for my M&S collaboration and she's filming me video. No, filming me vlog. And it's really awkward. <laughs> Shooting Christmas content. Actually, it looks really cute on this camera. Does it? Like with all the fairy lights. Oh, Look how seriously Hannah takes this. I love it. Just a Laptop, <laughs> wire, <laughs> camera. <laughs> but they're gonna look amazing. Nelson, are you gonna tell everyone what you did this morning? What did you do? Did you knock mummy's tree over? It's not focusing on you. Can't see you. He's obsessed with this umbrella, that's what it is. What is it? Oh, oh, he nearly fell. Oh. <laughs> oh, mate. No. Hey, everyone. I feel like I haven't spoken for ages. I don't, oh my God, ow. Oh. Um, I don't even know when I last vlogged. Was I shooting with Hannah? I must have been. I think I sort of gave up shooting halfway, th vlogging halfway through because it was just so long. It was amazing. We got so much stuff done all of December, all of January, and by MS collaboration, but six hours. And I was up late, really late last night prepping for it, so I'm just so exhausted now. So I'm on the sofa. I need to get a blog post up tonight. I've got loads of blogging to do, loads of emails to do, so I'm just gonna do that, but I'm gonna throw on a girly film, I think, whilst I do it, so I, at least I feel like I've done something for me today, but 
not that blogging is not for me but you know what I mean so yeah I'm just exhausted I'm gonna treat myself to a katsu curry but not a wagamama's one of the Tesco ones which actually isn't that bad um because I've not really eaten either so yeah so tired but I have to stay in here to make sure Nelson doesn't pop over the Christmas tree again otherwise I'd probably rather be in bed but I, I think I'd fall asleep if I was in bed so yeah I'm gonna throw on a movie and I will check in with you guys a bit later oh can you see me now I think I went down too much good night good morning today is Tuesday so obviously this vlog started on Sunday yesterday I worked all day I've got an admin job so I did that all day and then in the evening I didn't really do much I just chilled with Finn we watched suits and I just really needed some time you know I've been vlogging all week I don't see Finn much because he studies and he works like seven days a week so I just decided that I was going to have the night off and recharge which was good so we're starting afresh today, it's Tuesday, I've just been and got my nails done, so they're all sparkly for Christmas. I'll probably get them done once more before Christmas, but I thought, like, rose gold sparkle, why is it not focusing? Oh, rose gold sparkle for December would be a good way to go. Um, so I'm actually getting my hair cut today, which I'm super excited about. So I'm going away at the weekend for a long weekend in Palma, which is one of my favourite places. Um, and I just, I had my hair cut a few months ago and I loved it shorter and it's just grown so fast. I just need it gone, it's annoying me. So I'm getting my hair cut, but before I go to get my hair cut, I'm going to edit last week's vlog. Hopefully, it depends how long it's going to take me. But I really, really want to get that up this evening because if I don't get it up, then I'm not doing it. So that's what I'm going to do now. And then this afternoon, the plan is to try and get to the gym because I didn't go yesterday and I feel so guilty when I don't go. So I need to get to the gym this afternoon. And I've also got to go buy some sandbags for my, pe for my re personal reassurance that Nelson is not going to knock over the Christmas tree because he's trying so hard not to because he knows he gets in trouble bless him but he's a cat he wants to play so Finn's going to come with me and we're going to go and buy some industrial sandbags but we're going to wrap them up and just put them on the stand so hopefully even if he goes on the tree it'll be too heavy to actually knock over so yeah and I'm just making some breakfast got my eggs so here we are, breakfast time. I've got eggs that I just did in olive oil, so it's technically not as bad. Leftover baked beans because Finn had them last night and I hate wasting food, so I just thought I'm just gonna have those with my gluten-free toast, which has got avocado spread as opposed to butter. Not as nice, I know, but it's healthier. My little apple and mango, and then I got myself a soya, vanilla latte from Costa because they're my fave and I just love the little Christmas cups very appropriate for vlogmas so there's all the footage from last week which you will have seen now yeah let's get this edited because it's making me stress oh you're so beautiful are you eyeing up my Christmas tree it's mummy's okay bye I got my hair cut! Look how short it is! It is amazing! I love it! It's going to be so quick and easy to dry and wash. Woo! And the Christmas tree's still up! Every time I go out now, I'm like, please don't let Nelson knock over the Christmas tree, please! <laughs> so yeah, it's still up. And my hair is super short, but I love it. I think it actually really suits me being this length. Let's go to a mirror. That might look easier. That might be easier to see how short it is. Ooh, yellow light, yellow light. Right. Ooh. Yes. Look how short it is. It's actually like a long bob now, which is crazy. Oh my god, I look really like much bigger on camera than I am in real life. Love it. It looks nice with some curls in as well. So yes, I need to finish editing last week's vlog and then I'm gonna finish my blog post for tomorrow. 
And then I'm gonna go to the gym, and then I need to come home and do some work for my clients, and then it's the evening, and Phil and I are gonna go buy some sandbags. What an exciting life we lead. <laughs> I feel like I've been super bad at vlogging this week so far. I don't know what's happened. I don't even know when I last vlogged today. So all I've done today is work. And then this evening I went to home base with Finn and we got, we got sandbags to try and keep the Christmas tree down to stop Nelson getting it. We had a McDonald's for dinner, which was yum. And... I've just been wrapping presents. It hasn't really been that interesting. Um, yeah, so I've also been attempting to upload last week's vlog and I've just remembered why I used to find YouTube so stressful. It's not uploaded and it's been uploading for like four hours, so that's crazy. Maybe my internet's just super, super bad, but... So yeah, I'm going to go to bed now. It's like 20 to 11, I have to get up at 6 because I'm going to a body balance class which I have to go to and then I'm just working tomorrow but I'm going to try and vlog a bit more because this week's just being a bit boring so far it's probably because I'm not going to see Abby Morning! That was a bit loud I just got back from the gym so I'm feeling super proud of myself it's 10 past 8 and I've already worked out so I'm going to get ready and I'm going to go meet my grandma for some breakfast before we go to work and look who's awake look who's awake the naughty kitten is awake oh he's got a lovely tail oh mummy just leave me alone <laughs> right let's get ready Nelson let's get ready he's just so happy he's just so happy Today's outfit, my khaki coat with my new look floral dress, my new hair, love it, and just some ruffle boots. <sighs> work is done! I actually left a bit early, but it's dark so early, it's only half four. <sighs> so I'm going to go home, tidy up, change and make sure the tree is still up. And I'm going to spend the evening with Finn and I th I'm going to go to his house and hopefully we're just going to chill. But I really want to get some more presents wrapped so yeah. And then tomorrow, full day of work. I am going away on Saturday though so I can't really complain can I? Oh my gosh, I look so tired. I really struggled to get my Kylie lip kit off, it was really annoying me. So I've taken off like half my makeup. Very well. I've just pushed my first vlog live and that was really scary. I don't know why, I suddenly feel like, oh, I don't know, I feel really nervous. But I think the problem is that like, I've been so used the whole time I've been online, well the majority of time apart from that little tiny YouTube tryout, it's all been photos and writing and it's so different to, to vlogging like this is me showing you like everything about my life and believe it or not I'm actually such a private person so yeah this is a little bit weird but I'm gonna roll with it I'm gonna I'm still gonna try it out I might not like it but yeah I just feel really nervous like I hope people like it I hope I get some views but We'll see, not everything's meant to be, but you do have to give things a try first. 
So I'm going to go and have some dinner and I'm going to try and have an early night because I've got another busy working day tomorrow. And then Friday I'm having a day for me, I'm going to chill, I'm going to pack and then I'm going to Palma. Where are you going? What are you doing? Nelson, can we be friends forever? You're just so pretty. Look at you, you're just so handsome. I just want to squish you all the time. Don't bite me. He loves me really. You right, baby? Yeah. Just having a little sing song? Yeah. What are you singing? Do you want to sing it again? No. Come on. No, I'm Go on, just for me. You look too good in me. <laughs> Go on. No one can see you, they can just hear you. Sing me a little song. Trouble. What's he doing? In trouble. You naughty cat. Too hard. Too hard. Nelson keeps trying to get into my boots bag and nick my cotton wool pads. Has he got them again? No, he's got my hand. How many baubles has he knocked off? Yeah, a lot. Also, how cute is that little fairy on top of the tree? Mum got it for me. I'm talking to you. Yeah, that's cute. Do you like it, Nelson? Why do you knock it off? Don't do that. Give him to me. Put him right here. He won't like it. or run straight away. Come to mummy. <laughs> Yay! Oh, you're so beautiful. He's grumpy. He's gonna run. And go, Nelson, go! Nelson, go! Good morning! My hair looks so short in a ponytail. It's freaking me out. I wanted to quickly show you my skirt because I got this skirt. It looks much better with a bit of a heel in new look. And I am wearing it so, so much. I wanted to give it a little bit of a credit. This is not an ad or anything. I just absolutely love it. It's so comfy. So this was my meeting outfit. <laughs> I've just got home. It's about 10. Nelson's upset because he got not locked out of the lounge because he was ruining my tree. So today it's 10 o'clock, I've done my meeting and to be honest I am so tired. So what I'm going to do is make some breakfast, tidy up and then I'm literally just going to get into bed with my laptop, throw on some Kardashians <laughs> and do some work and then I think about 2-3 after lunch I might go to the gym, do a bit of cardio and then come home and I'm just, I've been so mentally busy the last few weeks that I just need to chill and tomorrow I can finish up all my work and then, oh he's gone, and then pack for Saturday which is exciting. Current situation, lunch, work, friends, cat. <laughs> I'm on a bit of a diet, so I've got chicken cooked with soy sauce and honey and broccoli. Which is good because it's protein and no carbs. Carbs are like my weak point and they really make me put on weight, so... Oh, I just love friends so much! Somebody fell asleep mid-play. Somebody was playing with mummy's foot and then fell asleep. Oh, it's such a hard life, Nelson. Such a hard life. <laughs> no music, I love it. Bath time.
morning. Oh my god, I look so tired. It's because I am. My hair. So I'm just sat at my desk. It's early. And I'm just finishing up some blog work for my MS collaboration. Ooh, and it's gone on my Instagram, so I just need to upload this. Um, I'll be back in one second. Oh, Instagram's really getting on my nerves today. Oh, boobs out. Um, so the reason my hair looks such a mess, this is my little hair secret, and it's the only thing I actually do to try and look after it. So, everyone always says to me, oh, your hair looks really healthy, especially seeing as I've had it coloured a few times. And the one thing I do, different, well, I, I mean, I use really good shampoos and conditioners because I decided that you don't actually spend that much more money because you don't use as much and my hair since using it is so much better but in January I'm actually going to be doing a whole video and blog post on this so I'm going to leave that for now but the one thing I do is sort of once a fortnight is I condition my hair but I leave it in overnight so last night I had a really nice relaxing bath and I got my hair wet and I just covered it drenched it in normal conditioner and then I also drenched it in my um, my blue conditioner or purple conditioner which is the one that basically takes out the brassy tones so I like my hair to be quite white blonde as opposed to yellow blonde um, yeah so I do that I literally obviously it's a bit wet for a little bit so I put it in a ponytail and then put a towel around it and I basically sleep I just put the towel on my pillow and it doesn't Sorry, Nelson. He do it doesn't really do anything to my pillow or anything. And then in the morning, it's sort of a bit... I don't even know what the word is. Sticky. But it's sort of dried. And then all I do now is I'll jump in the shower and I will do a double shampoo, but I won't condition. And it is... Honestly, it's so good for your hair. You wouldn't... I think just having that extra bit of time just to soak in... It's really good and also I do all my roots so when I wash my hair normally I don't tend to condition my roots I just sort of brush over but I mainly condition the ends so this makes sure that like my whole head is really being looked after and I think it's actually really good for your scalp as well so I used to get a really really dry scalp and now I've, I've never had it since doing this so whatever conditioner you use is probably really good I mean I can't speak for everything I don't know about every conditioner but yeah, it's a really good tip if you if you need to look after your hair and particularly if you use a lot of heat on it. So yeah, so I'm just finishing up some work. I'm going to be here for a couple of hours and then I'm going to get ready and I'm going to do some things. So obviously I will take you with me. How cute are my Christmas PJs? They're super soft as well. Oh, Abby and I got matching for Christmas. Woo! I'm gonna wash my hair now. Look how gross it looks. Hair washed. How much better does that look? Look how short it looks. I've not washed it since having it cut. I'm gonna turn my music off. I'm gonna pop to the gym now to meet Lucy, ooh, um, gym with Lucy, and then I've got to go to Sainsbury's in the post office and then coming home. And I'm gonna do my ASOS Zara little haul then. Oh, that's just a gym top. I've got, in here I think I've got three dresses. And then in here, last night I ordered a coat. And what else did I order? I ordered something else and that's really bad. I can't remember what it was. Zara have got a really good sell on at the moment so if you want something go and have a look I got the coat like half price so pretty chuffed about that let's hope it fits anyway yeah so this week I am actually going to try and take you with me to the gym so I'm going to remember my camera first thing and then I'm going to remember to actually film so two things I think Lucy will help me though she's so into the whole video thing because she used to do YouTube so she was like if you want to do workouts just let me know and I was like yes so I'm really happy that she's up for doing that because I think that might be a fun thing to do in the new year. So if you want to see some fitness videos, let me know and I will talk to her and see what we can do because I think it'll be fun. Probably more on like the home workout 
spectrum than that in the gym but yeah let me know this is miss lady hunter working her legs ready for the christmas extravaganza Good, don't tuck the tailbone push it back all the way back that's it yeah Work it, work it. Last one coming up. Be hot, Abby. <laughs> okay, this is one for the glutes. Squeeze in the bum. Pushing it back straight. Go straight. Yeah. Twelve on each side. How many is that? <laughs> Eight. Nine. Last one. Good. Can you feel can you feel it getting harder? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> enjoy watching me box I was having a great time ish take my shoes off I just got home so I went to the gym did my errands I love saying errands I feel really American um made myself a coffee because I forgot to buy one I thought I would quickly show you do the haul because the lights going on it's pretty much dark now it's half four um I thought I'd do the little haul now and then I got to wrap some presents and pack so yeah let's get going on the haul and then see where the evening takes us i'm on my own tonight so that usually means i get loads done when i'm on my own because i don't just sit on the sofa and watch telly so first things first i ordered these they're just black jeans however i misread they're actually um coated so they're like slightly leather look to be honest i actually quite like them so i'll keep them but I just kind of wanted some easy black jeans, so I might have to order something else. But they are quite nice, and I think they'll look really nice with the next item. Yes. Box is now mine, human. This is my box. You can't have it back, Mum. Hmm? This piece, oh my god, I love it so much. So I got this coat in tan earlier in the season, and I love it. And this was reduced from 80 to 50, and I was like, oh, I've got to do it. And it's just like a really nice deep red. It's beautiful, a tailored coat. I wear my tan one all the time. It's a little bit big. I got, I got, what did I get? Did I get large or extra large? So Zara, I'm usually a large, because let's be honest, if you're not a size 6 in Zara, you're usually a large. I mean, I'm not fat, but... So I got an extra large, because the only problem with my tan one is... I can't wear all my jumpers underneath because they're too tight, it's too tight, so I got this thinking that this means I can then wear it with all my jumpers, and even without a jumper, even if it's big, it's just oversized, isn't it, so I love this. Oh, and this is also going to look really nice with my new MK, which I don't know if I've showed you yet. This is the one I got in Cheshire Oaks when I was there last week with Abby, but how nice is this going to look? in Parma this weekend it's black boots, red coat, black bag oh it looks very European very Spanish, I love it this, this coat's a bargain definitely have a look at the Zara sale because it's so good so this dress has taken me by surprise a bit I actually quite like it, not with these shoes, they're not high enough 
it's just like shimmery midi I need a bra on and I definitely need a leg tan but what's taking me by surprise I thought it was just grey with shimmer it's actually leopard the pattern on it is leopard like really subtle leopard and I think that's really nice because some things are a bit like in your face leopard but I'm not sure it doesn't I think so it's from ASOS but it's actually a river island I'm not sure how I feel about it the thing is I like it but I don't think I like it enough to actually wear it so it's not really worth keeping is it what do you think let me know I'm not even put into words how much I love this dress it doesn't quite do it justice on the camera I've never felt more like Carrie Bradshaw in my whole life oh my god excuse all of Finian's mess it's so beautiful it's just literally a black pleated dress with like the lowest back you've ever seen and then yeah it's super long I'm 100% keeping this but I think I might have to get it taken up because I've put a heel on and it's like I couldn't even walk in this I'd have to hold it so I might have to get a little bit off the length but I love it Oh, I might try it with a belt and see if that works. This belt has actually done the trick. I can walk in it now, but I think the belt makes it look a bit dressy. Oh, I'm going to keep it and get it taken up. So I think if it's flowy, you can get away with it being literally like day to evening, whereas with a belt, and I couldn't wear this in the day. I just look like an idiot. I look like I'm going to prom. But I love it. So beautiful. I'll put all the links to what I'm sharing, by the way so you can see but it's such a beautiful dress I love it I love the back all the lack of the back even and then last but by no means least this beautiful red dress I picked this mainly because I love how the um oh my gosh shoulders detail it's off shoulder slightly but it's not if you get what I mean it's just midi pencil dress I chuck the belt on so I think that looks quite nice. I love it. I think I'm going to take this away with me. Woo! Easy ASOS red dress. I will link it below. This is definitely a bargain. I love it. Perfect for Christmas party or New Year's now. Probably on to New Year's, aren't we? Oh my god. I've eaten so much today. I look pregnant. <sighs> there we go. Last one. Just going to clean up the madness that is of haul videoing. And then time to wrap some presents. Do you love my print? It says, it's, oh my god, it's, <laughs> I'm a blogger, what's your superpower? And then, what would Blair Waldorf do? I can't really think of two quotes more suited to my life. I am totally finishing up some work. Old wine. I just ate so much bread and pate as well. So bad for you, but so good. Yeah, so just finishing up some blog posts for December. I'm actually working on January as well now, which is mad, mental. Um, yeah, and then I'm gonna wrap some presents. So, but I can't really show you guys what I'm wrapping because I don't want anyone to see what. I'm wrapping if my friends and family actually watch this, so. It's so good. I am so tired, but I've just finished up making my media kit, which has been on my to-do list for so long, and I desperately needed one, so. Yeah, I've just made a little one here. I won't show you too much, because it's got like my fee sheet and everything, and I don't really think I should share that with everyone, but. <laughs> It's just going to be a PDF document that I can send to people and yeah, hopefully they'll want to work with me, you never know. What film am I going to watch? Any guesses? It's a classic. It takes me back to being about, I don't even know, 14? How old was I? I feel like I was younger. Ooh, this is taking a while, isn't it? Come on! 
Oh, I put the heating on so high in here, I now feel like my whole face is about to shrivel up. Finian is going to hate me. It's totally twilight. <laughs> oh my god, she looks so young. This is mad. I don't think I've watched this for years.